Meryl. What is it? Oh no. Meryl, get down. Meryl. No, she got shot. Holy sh! Snake, leave me and run. Meryl. I guess I am a rookie after all. Don't worry, Meryl. It's me they want. Even I know that. It's the oldest trick in the book. The sniper's using me for bait to lure you out. Damn. Shoot me, Snake. No. My gun. I can't reach it by myself. Don't move. I promised. I wouldn't slow you down. I... I... I, I can still help. I want to help you. Quiet down. Save your strength. I was a fool. I wanted to be a soldier, but war is ugly. There's nothing glamorous about it. Snake, please save yourself. Go on living and don't give up on people. Don't forget me. No. Now get out of here. Meryl! Damn. Snake, it's a trap. A sniper's trick to lure you out. The sniper's waiting for you to go and help Meryl, so he can pick you off. Don't do it. Must be Sniper Wolf, Foxhound's best shooter. Snipers usually work in pairs, but this one's alone, huh? I know her. She can wait for hours, days, or weeks. It doesn't matter to her. <laughs> She's just watching and waiting for you to expose yourself. Maybe so, but Meryl can't hold out that long. Snake, can you see Wolf from where you are? There's nowhere to hide between here and the tower. She must be on the second floor of the tower. If Wolf is in the communications tower, she can see you perfectly. It's the classic sniper's position. At that distance, you won't be able to hit her with a standard weapon either. You'll need a sniper rifle. Colonel, take it easy. <sighs> I'm gonna save Meryl, no matter what it takes. Okay. Thanks. What's wrong, Naomi? Nothing. I'm just surprised you're willing to sacrifice yourself. You got the genes of a soldier, not a savior. <laughs> you trying to say that I'm only interested in saving my own skin? I wouldn't go that far, but... I don't know what the hell my genes look like, and I don't care. I operate on instinct. Like an animal? I'm going to save Meryl. I don't need an excuse. Okay. And I'm not doing it for someone else either. I'm gonna save Meryl for myself. Colonel, don't <laughs> worry. Snake, thanks. I understand. I'm sorry. Okay, it's been like a week since I played this game, so I'm probably gonna be really bad at it. Let's fucking go. Oh, also, the the way the, the last stream ended was somebody backseated what I should do at this at this point. So I know what I need to do because somebody backseated and then I just stopped playing. To stop the terrorist nuclear attack on one, one must deactivate the detonation code or destroy Metal Gear itself. Snake and Meryl head for the communications tower, the only way to the underground maintenance base. Foxhound member Sniper Wolf fires at them and Meryl is badly wounded. It is... It is a trap to lure out Snake. Snake must get a PSG-1 to beat Wolf and save Meryl. All right. You apologize? I thought you were kidding. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Okay. The person... I'll try I'll try to forget the spoil, but the person already told me what to do. Um, so... Um, I need to call Adaka. <laughs> Thanks to the person who told me to do it. Otacon, have you ever seen a sniper rifle anywhere on this base? A sniper rifle? Meryl's been shot by an extremely good sniper. Sniper? A high-quality sniper rifle is the only way I can fight back. I, uh, I saw a PSG-1 in the armory in the second floor basement of the tank hangar. The second floor basement of the tank hangar? I have to go all the way back there? Well, 
Yeah. Wait, really? What's wrong with you, Otacon? Nothing. Wait, wouldn't Meryl just die? Uh, how do I play this game again? Oh no! Snake, leave me. No, fuck. Get out of here, Snake. Ah, this is bad. Oh god, we have to go back to the dog zone? Wait, I thought we were friends now! Nope, not there. Fuck. Stop! I hate the dog zone so much. I thought we were friends! Oh, it's right there. Shit. Get out of the way. This is why I'm afraid of dogs. They bite you. I mean, obviously not all of them, but you know what I mean. Things are going well. They are friends with Meryl. They were just tolerating me. Okay. What's this? Hooray. This is the room, the room where Mantis explained to me that he can't read. Which is very sad. Box time. I swear to God, if there's another tank out here, I'm gonna be really mad. Fucking sheesh. Okay, uh... <gasps> God damn it. I want these. Mind diffusal stream? I'm just gonna crawl over all of them. Alright, are we back in the tank hangar yet? The second floor basement, so I need to find the elevator. Don't mind me. Mm hmm You don't need to come over here, so don't kick me over. Get out of the way. Why is he doing that? <laughs> they don't trust the original one. I'm gonna use this one. I thought I was being smart. Oops. Where is the elevator? Oh shit. Just a box. Why? Get out of the way. What am I doing wrong? It's a bug, you think? Should I, re should I rerun the game? It's a code bug? Okay. An AI quirk? Okay. The bug is part of the experience. Okay. Well, I thought corners were a smart thing, a smart place to hang out.
Yay. <laughs> Fucking so smooth. What? What cat? It's not your turn. Mom said that I could play until the timer went off on the oven, okay? It's not your turn, Harmony. Stop, Harmony, you're cheating. Anyway. Well, we did it. Yep, I... Oh, sheesh. Uh, last week I tested, I started testing negative. Okay, we gotta find the armory. Don't knock Kirby over, Harmony. Damn, I missed the call. Oh, no, I didn't. The place is protected by infrared sensors. Somehow you'll have to make it past the beam. Oops. If you have any questions about weapons or equipment, you should ask our military analyst, Nastasha. Her frequency is 141.52. I still haven't called that lady. Damn. This is Nastasha. Oh, it's time to hear this call for the 50th to time. Your solid snake. A snake, that room is set with infrared sensors. You should be able to see them if you had some smoke or cigarette smoke or something. Because I, but these are smokeless. I've called her a bunch, but every time I called her, I died after, so I haven't technically called her. Down on secondhand smoke. Oh well, don't worry. If you blow the smoke in the direction of the infrared sensors, you should be able to see them. Okay. That was a good idea, bringing the cigarettes, but uh, don't smoke too much. Cigarettes make you weak in mind and body. They are bad for you. Damn it. Nobody can find me when I'm in my comfy box. <laughs> no one will ever, ever bother me. You te you text her instead of call. I would too normally. What now, beats? Do not knock over the zebra cakes, beats. You guys are driving me crazy right now. You hope Abby's in the remake. Me too. I think it'd be fun. It'd be kind of cool. Oh, this is where I fought that guy. Beats, stop! Ow. Nice, a bunch of my hair got ripped out. Look at that. You can't tell, but it's a lot. Beats! She hopped in the bag, in the box where I put that piece of my hair, and there was a piece of plastic in it. <sighs> They're fucking crazy right now. So I just kicked them both out. Now they have to live with that. They have to live with their choices. This is what I get for giving them treats. <laughs> They're both in jail. It wasn't just treats. They also... Beats also has pika, so she likes to eat plastic. So when she realized there was plastic, she was trying to get that. They wanted the treat. Like, I put the, the treats away so they couldn't get them, but there was like three bags of treats and I forgot one. So that's why she was climbing up there. And so I just kicked them both out of the room. Oh yeah, she eats a... Uh, she likes to eat hair ties. Hair ties and, and uh, plastic. They're backseating their, uh, me giving them treats. Mr. Box. Who's that? Damn it, I died. Okay, this guy is like on a super tight little back and forth. Huh? How did How did he see me? I wanted to hug him. I don't know why it flipped him. Well, this would be a lot easier if it wasn't for these barrels. Fuck barrels. Snake, consider picking the barrels up. 
Hooray. Hello. You got a PSG-1. You can use that against Sniper Wolf. Hurry up and save Meryl. I'll fucking try. Dee dee dee. I didn't realize you can move along collision. Dee 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 dee. <laughs> it's cool that he actually has the goggles on. I didn't realize that. Yeah, I am enjoying this game. I'm very bad at it, but I'm having fun. What the fuck? Where is it? There we go. Puppy! My nose is so red. Oh god. What the hell is happening? I have to get down to shoot? Where is she? Oh shit! God damn it! Okay, I saw her. Meryl's gone, fuck. Wow, this is so clunky. Damn it. Where are you at, lady? I didn't have my rations on me. Okay. Okay, let me... Oh, we can use that to make it so we can shoot better. I bet I can use these to see better, too. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, good. There... Um... Where is it? Where is she? There's a rat. There she is. Where are you at, lady? Damn it! Where is she? Damn it! I, I hit her! No! Where is she? I got her. I should maybe take that. I got her. Where is she? I got her. Ah! Um. Where is she? I got her! Um... wear these in case there's any kind of bullshit. First try. No! Don't move! <laughs> it's hard to miss when you're this close. Toss your weapon over here. Yeah. Slowly. I killed you, though. You are a fool to come back here, stupid man. A lady sniper, huh? Didn't you know that two-thirds of the world's greatest assassins are women? That's fucking dope. Do you want to die now? Big if true. Or after your female friend. Which will it be? I'll die after I kill you. 
Is that right? Well, at least you've got spirit. I am Sniper Wolf, and I always kill what I aim at. You oh. aimed at me multiple times and did You're not kill my me. Special prey. Got it? No. Huh. Oh, I've left my mark on you. I won't forget it. Until I kill you. You're all I think about. Okay. I'm just laughing that she's supposed to be really sexy. But she's just like a pixel like she's just like Take a blocky lady, so it's just funny. I don't know. This sucks though. They're taking me back. I made all this progress. I did shoot her like five times, but she just didn't care. There's no getting through to that woman. Leave it to me. I want no more Use my imagination. Yes, he's my target. My idol. Well, they're fighting over me. I know. Uh, I, I mean, I've been playing games since the 64. It's just funny at these, at, you know, <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> I do hear you. They're operating on me. What's going on? Mm. I always knew you're that my one brother, day aren't you? I would meet you. The man who stole what was rightly mine. The man who stole my birthright. Can I look around? Forget it. Oh, I can. Your body is strapped down tight. Me? I'm the man you stole everything good from. First person mode. This is now, actually like a cool after effect. After the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Which one am I? Six door. Damn it, I can't get Do through the six door. DNA too? Yes. I want a sample while he's still alive. We need it to correct the genome soldier's mutations. Then we'll be able to cure them. Oh no! There definitely is a resemblance, don't you think, little brother? I skipped it. Or should I? I didn't say mean to skip it, brother. Yeah, I'm not sure. I didn't mean to skip hey, it. I was trying to it escape. I you didn't mean I to. You both the last survivors. Press the Damn it, I did it again, I did it again. To regain your strength. When you've had enough, uh. press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. I didn't mean there to. There are no continues, my friend. Just look it up later. Okay, I'll look it up later. You don't even think about using auto fire, or I'll know. Snake, it's been a long time since you saved your game. Yeah? So what? If your body can't survive the torture, it'll be game over. You really want to travel down that long road again? Come on, I won't tell. Why don't you just give up? I'm going to run a high voltage electric current <laughs> through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. But I never heard that before. You're a tough guy, Snake. But I've got some bad news for you. You're no POW. You're a hostage. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Okay. Let's get started. I'm so upset right now. Okay, here we go. How did you like that? Shall we go again? Oh. God. Oh God. Ah! Had enough yet? We're not finished yet. Oh God, oh God, God. No! 
I died. Ocelot, you did it again. Sorry, boss. No! Now I know what to do, that's true. It's a good thing I saved my game before I went and fought her because uh, that would have fucking sucked. Yes, I did. I saved. I canceled? I've been playing this game for like two hours. <laughs> no! Um, um. They can come out here? <laughs> I'm getting a drink. I'm so upset right now. This sucks. God fucking damn it. I don't even... I... <laughs> I'm never gonna beat this game. Oh shit. I thought it would be fine. Ah. Ah. Uh, Chris and Tara, thank you for the gift sub to remember to save. Fuck. Thank you, Spartan. I want to go in here and get all that cool stuff I found earlier. That was stolen from me. No. Okay. I hate this part. You prayed to, uh, Hideo Kojima for me. Thank you. The part where I redo the last like two hours of the stream. That's the part of the game we're at. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Hi, puppy. All right, let's call the uh, what's her face. Snake, you saw the Tan Raider. I know. I can't use it in a narrow space like this, right? Right. I'm sorry. No reason to apologize. Even the greatest masterpiece has its flaws. In China, they say, rashness brings success to few, misfortune to many. Snake, go forward when it's safe, but retreat when there's danger. You'll just have to play it by ear depending on the circumstances. 
What was that? Something I can't have? Do I really have full rations? Is my health full? I guess so. I got her! I got her. <laughs> Okay, should I save again? Snake, wouldn't now be a good time to save your mission? What's going on? I'm not sure. I'm getting a bad feeling. Bad feeling? Something you ate? No, I'm serious. Like a premonition or something. Snake, it's all up to you. I can do it. I saved, right? Do not gaslight me. Russian. Yay, surgery. Do not skip. I won't skip. I'm sorry. The game was punishing me for skipping. Do you know who I am? No. I always knew that one day I would meet you. The man who stole what was rightly mine. The man who stole my birthright. Forget it. Your body is strapped down tight. Me? I'm yes, the man yes, you stole yes. everything good from. Thank you. And You're welcome, now, I mean. After the sacrifice of our brothers, after 30 long years, finally, the two of us meet. The brother of light and the brother of dark. Are you going to tell me which one you are? Do you need his DNA too? Yes. I want a sample while he's still alive. We need it to correct the genome soldiers' mutations. Then we'll be able to cure them? No. We still have to get our hands on Big Boss's DNA. Big Boss. Have they given in to our demands yet? Not yet. They won't give in. They're all hypocrites, every one of them. Is that your opinion as a Kurd? They always put politics first. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. There definitely is a resemblance, don't you think, little brother? Or should I say, big brother? I'm not sure. <laughs> anyway, it doesn't matter. You and I are both the last surviving Twinsies. sons of Big Boss. It's me. Really? Then what? Oof, those idiots! All right, Raven. I'll be right there. They're not responding to our demands. We launched the first one in 10 hours as planned. Damn Americans. Looks like you read them wrong. Damn Americans. Something's funny. Normally the Americans are the first ones to the negotiating table. <laughs> they must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. Ocelot? Want to voice actor is so show? good. I'm not interested. I got jokes to, to do. Feed the family. So you prefer your wolves to my show, huh? Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the chief. Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Well, his mental defenses were reinforced by hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? He's killed 12 men. Whoever he is, he's some kind of lunatic. Bastard took my hand. I want to believe the ninja How just... have gotten in here? Perhaps there's a spy. Here for fun. <laughs> Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out what killed Baker, an octopus. We're short-handed, so make this little torture show of yours as short as possible. Torture? This is an interrogation. As you wish. See you later, brother. 
See you, bro. This sucks. Your woman is still in this world. Meryl. Catch you later, handsome. Once she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Yeah, that's what she said. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before she kills them. That's sad. Finally, just the two of us. How are you feeling? Not bad. Caught a nice nap on this revolving bed of yours. Too bad I was sleeping alone. I'm glad to hear that. This is some bed, all right. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, carrier boy? So, Metal Gear is armed with a new type of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? Like, look at- <laughs> The Colonel. By the way, you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? What if I did? Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? Do not. That's fine. Um... Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. But if you want her to stay that way, you better start answering my questions right now. You were holding one card key. Where are the other two? What's the trick behind that key? Trick? That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. I see. No problem, then. We're going to play a game, Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear, just give up and your suffering will end. But if you do, the girl's life is mine. What? Okay, fuck. Now I, I'm glad I didn't Press the give up at least. Button repeatedly to regain your strength. Okay. When you've had enough, press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. No. There are no continues, my friend. All right, time to mash. Don't even think about using auto fire, or I'll know. What is that? Is that like an old? I'm going to run a high voltage electric current through your body. If it's just for a short time, it won't kill you. But we I never did heard the that mesh. before. You're a tough guy. We did Steve. the monster mesh. But I've got some bad news for you. Monster mesh. You're no POW. You're a hostage. Oh, okay. There's no Geneva Convention. No one is coming to save you. Starting to feel a little scared. Good. You should be. Okay. Let's get started. All right, let's go. Okay, here we go. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How did you like that? Shall we go again? <laughs> no. Finished yet. All right. Come on. Ah. 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 You still okay? Want me to go on? No. Can you take one more? Ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No! No. Ah! You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now, I think. You're the boss's brother, all right. Your brother, he's an amazing man. Who else could shoot down two F-16s with a hind helicopter? Uh. The Les Enfanteries project 
was not a total failure. He is the one man who could make my dream into a reality. Literally refresh. Refresh. Okay, bye. The Terrible Children Project. Thank you, Pillow. Looks like I got a roommate. Oh no! The DARPA chief? He dead! He's got buggies. What a stench. He's alive. Witch. She took my clothes. Uh, save? Okay. Snake, are you okay? I feel so scared for you. It must be horrible. Yeah, I, I've been through a lot worse. Believe me. Wow, you really are a hero. It's a good thing the codec is connected directly to your inner ear. You can contact us anytime. It's always nice to hear that you're alright. Why don't you contact the Colonel? If anyone can think of a way out, it's him. Please, Nick, don't give up. Okay. Ooh, Benny boy, thank you for resubscribing. Mera. They've got her. Damn. Snake, the government has decided not to give in to their demands. We're trying to buy some more time. Come on, Colonel. Why don't you stop playing dumb? I'm sorry about Merrill, but I want the lies to end now. What are you talking about? Metal Gear was designed to launch a new type of nuclear warhead, wasn't it? You knew it all along, He's like didn't you? Why did you try to hide it? I'm sorry. Can't tell the grunts, huh? You've changed a lot. Metal Gear, secret advanced nuclear weapons research. Does the White House know about this? How deep does it go? As far as I know, as of yesterday, the president had not been briefed about the Rex project. It's 2005, to no then. Basis. Is that the idea? These are sensitive George Bush times. was president. Even subcritical nuclear tests are causing quite a stir. Plausible deniability, George huh? George W. Bush. Yes. And tomorrow, the president and his Russian counterpart are scheduled to sign the START III Accord. I get it. That's the reason for the deadline. That's right, Snake. And that's why we can't let this terrorist attack go public. We still haven't even ratified START II or dealt with the issue of TMDs. This has to do with the president's reputation and America's place as the dominant superpower. So patriotism is your excuse for <laughs> circumventing the Constitution? Please, Snake. Just stop them. Why should I? Because you're the only one who can. Okay. In that case, tell me the truth about this new type of nuclear warhead. I told you before. I don't know the details. I don't believe you. If the situation is so serious, why don't you give in to their demands? Let them have Big Boss's remains. You see? Or is there some reason that you can't do that? Something you haven't told me about. Publicly, the president has been very vocal in his opposition to eugenics experiments. We Sounds don't like want w. the existence of the genome army to go public. And that's the only reason? Huh. Hell with you. <laughs> I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Oh, man. But it's strange. He looks and smells like he's been dead for days. All his blood's been drained out, too. Drained. Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? Right. But he's already started to decompose. What could it all be about? Something in his blood that they wanted? I doubt it. Just the nanomachines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It looks like they've got both codes and are nearly ready to launch. Damn. Is there any way to prevent it? It seems that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. 
It's a countermeasure that Armstech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. I'm sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Rex, no. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also, what? I know it's asking a lot. Meryl, right? Yeah. I'll save her. <laughs> Thanks. All right, let's see. Hey. Hey. He's sick. He's got COVID. What the hell are you doing? I'm playing. All right, let's uh let's try calling some more people. Otacon, are you still okay? Yeah. Thanks to the stealth camouflage that is. I have a favor to ask. I need your help. I was wondering when you'd ask, what should I do? I've been captured. I'm locked up here in this cell. What cell? There's a big torture machine nearby. Okay, I know it. It's close. <laughs> I'll be there right away. Thanks. All right, what's Deep Throat up to? Meryl. Master Miller. Hey. Normally. When a soldier is taken prisoner, he should only give up the big four. That's name, rank, serial number, and date of birth. But you're not any old soldier, Snake. I don't want you to tell them anything. Fortunately, you're strong enough to resist. Shut up! I'll punch you. Shut up in there, will ya? The only other person I haven't called is that lady that will tell me her life story. This is Nastasha Romanenko. A pleasure to work with you, Solid Snake. This lady I've called You're a million the times. the specialist that the colonel mentioned? Just because you are locked up does not mean there is no chance of escape. Keep your eyes and ears open, and when you see a chance, take it. Okay. Ah. Uh. Snake, it's showtime. Asala wants you. Uh-oh. Do I have to do this again? Okay. I think I'll I missed my chance. Once more. Damn, I have to do this again? Fuck. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, press the select button to submit. Ugh. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my I, friend. I have an idea of what to do. I fought I saved. wars in Afghanistan, Mozambique. Eritrea. Once I get back Chad. in there, I have an idea. Among the Mujahideen guerrillas, I was known and feared as Shalashaska. I was trained by the Russian Gru. I am not like one of those KGB slugs. To me, this isn't torture. It's a sport. You're all just a bunch of sadists. Don't confuse me with those uniform fools. Well, shall we begin? Okay, here we go. How did you like that? Shall we go again? Enough yet? Uh -huh. We're not finished yet. You still okay? Want me to go on? Can you take one more? Uh -huh.
I did it. You're a strong man. Well, that's enough for now, I think. We live in a sad age. Imperialism, totalitarianism, perestroika. 20th century Russia has had its share of problems, but at least they had an ideology. Russia today has nothing. They're struggling between freedom and order, and with that struggle, a new spirit of nationalism has been born. Mm. The boss has a close friend high up in the Russian government. He's currently the head of Spetsnaz. He's agreed to purchase this new nuclear weapons system. The Hind was just a down payment. So you're in this for money? I don't need money. I want Russia to be reborn, to lead a brave new world order. Is there anything I can do? Yeah, my arm hurts. <laughs> Poor snake. I'll increase the level of painkillers in your blood. Okay, but you can leave out the benzedrine. That stuff makes me too frisky. <laughs> I guess you're not feeling too bad after all. Snake, put the controller up against your arm. What? Don't worry, it'll feel good. Huh? Okay, here I go. <laughs> How does that feel, Snake? A little better? How did you do that? I stimulated your muscle fibers with the nanomachine cilia. <laughs> That's about all I can do for you. Naomi, please talk to me. Say something to take my mind off the pain. What can I say? Anything. I... Yeah. I'm not a very good talker. Please. Tell me about yourself. Myself? That's a tough one. Any family? That's not a happy topic for me. Mm -hmm. I don't have any family. No. Wait. There was a man who said he was my father. Where is he? What is this song? Dead. By my own hand. Oh, shit. Big Boss. What? Big Boss? I had no idea. There was no way you could. It happened in Zanzibar six years ago. No. Only Snake and I know the real truth of what happened there. So... Is it true? Was Big Boss really your father? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill him? Knowing that? Yep. Sad. How? He wanted it. Besides, some people just need killing. That's petricide. Yep. That's the trauma that Mantis was talking about. The one we share in common. Is that why you left Foxhound? Let's just say that I needed to be alone for a while. And Alaska was the perfect place. His delivery of, yep. <sighs> Snake. really nice. I didn't have a real family either. Just a big brother who put me through school. We weren't even blood related and he was much older than me. Where is he? He's dead. I'm sorry. Snake. Is there a woman in your life? After you've been through as many wars as me, it's hard to trust anyone. Hmm. Friends? Roy Campbell. <laughs> <laughs> You're still calling He's me his friend? Bestie. Is that it? No. There was another. Frank Yeager. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. And the only member of Foxhound ever to receive the code name Fox. Sheesh. Gray Fox. Oh. I learned a lot from him. But d didn't you try to kill each other? That's true. We did, in Zanzibar. But it was nothing personal. We were just professionals on opposite sides, that's all. And you still call yourself friends? Hard to believe. War is no reason to end a friendship. That's insane. I first met him on the battlefield. He was being held a prisoner of outer heaven. But he didn't look like a prisoner to me. Mm. He was always so cool and precise. I was still green, and he showed me the ropes. You knew him well? 
No. We never talked about our personal lives. Sort of an unwritten rule. The next time I saw him on the battlefield, we were enemies. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. I know it sounds strange to most people, but we were just two soldiers doing our jobs. It's like a sport. Men in their games. You're like wild animals. You're right. We are animals. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. <sighs> it's your genes. They make you predisposed towards violence. You really like talking about genes, Naomi. Why did you get into genetic research anyway? I never knew who my parents were, or even what they looked like. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why I am the way I am. So you studied about DNA? <laughs> yeah. I thought if I studied my genetic structure, you studied about I'd find DNA. out who I really DNA. was. It's a really weird so way to phrase that, that sentence. I thought by analyzing a person's genetic information, I could retrieve the blank spots in that person's memory. Memory is stored in DNA? We're not sure, but we know that a person's genetic fate is determined just by the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. So what about my fate? You know really? my DNA sequence, don't you? Your fate? I've... I'm sorry, I have no idea. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Chief. You don't hurry up and get me out of here. I'll be laying next to him. Those bastards. This lock won't open with a security card. You need a key like the soldiers carry. So what are you doing here then? I... I thought you might be hungry. Aww. If you need more food, I can bring some more later. Run tuna and catch up. I got you this level six card. It'll get you out of that torture room. Let's go. Here. Take this, too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm Syndrome to me. <laughs> I was taking care of the dogs here. After the terrorists took over, they were planning to shoot all the dogs. No, the doggies. But Sniper Wolf stopped them. She even let me feed them when I asked. She likes dogs. She must be a good person. Please don't hurt her. Wake up, you idiot. She's the one who shot Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a nuke. I've got to stop them. Then you have to get past the communications tower. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. You have to. I'd I'll be killed. He's coming back. See you later. Wait. Huh? He's gone. I did it. Where could he possibly be? <laughs> I got ketchup. Toilet. I'm go potty. Was that all my stuff? Oh shit.
Oh. Is this where I was earlier, where I met Meryl? Looks like you escaped. I'm glad. No thanks to you. Too bad. I thought you'd be able to figure out what my plan was. What are you talking about? I was just lucky that security was careless. Oh, was it, he had a plan with the thing? With the food? Ketchup? To get to the underground base where Metal Gear is, you'll have to climb the communications tower on the north side of the cave. Oh, shit. There we go. Snake, there's a bomb planted in your items. Hurry, throw it away. Who the hell are you? One of them? You'll find out soon enough. Uh, what? Okay. That was a close one, Snake. Ocelot, you'll pay for that. That Deep Throat's a real enigma. He's definitely from inside their ranks. Is he an informer? Maybe some kind of renegade? I've got the feeling there's some other force at work here. 